Remains of a New Bedford soldier have been returned home. He was killed during a training exercise in California. But as WBZ's Paul Burton reports, the coronavirus pandemic will thwart his family's attempt at a memorial service. He was like a leader in the community, so there's a lot of people want to come out and show and show their respect for him, and they can't. Army Private First Class Justin Kirby served his country. Now the young 21-year-old soldier is being laid to rest with just his immediate family members in attendance. It's really hard because we originally got told we were allowed to have 20 people, then turned to 15, and then it was 10. The family says Kirby was born to serve his country. Unfortunately, his life was cut short earlier this month while taking part in an exercise in Fort Irwin National Training Center in California. They do warfare simulation, and uh, <laughs> there was an accident that took place that took his life. He met every challenge. Um, he was just, he had a beautiful heart, so many special gifts. The family fights back tears as his body is returned home. He received a private state police escort from Logan Airport to his home city of New Bedford. He was a positive person and he would do absolutely anything for anyone, especially me. And um, he just gave me hope. Because of the coronavirus, not a lot of people are allowed to attend the funeral. So the family is asking people to line the streets in New Bedford to pay their respects. A private burial with military honors will be held in Sacred Heart Cemetery in New Bedford. Painful. It was going to be really beautiful. Um, but we've, we've decided to um, get him home and get him in place um, in case the state shuts down or. He would know that you guys can not come, but I'm sure I'd appreciate everyone showing up. With a deep love for the arts and sailing, the family wants people to know he cared about them. Don't forget him. The city of New Bedford has been more than gracious. In Boston, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.